Hello, this is Chris from Polytech and this video we are going to learn how to run animated banners to our site using the Elementor page builder and its premium add-ons for Elementor plugins. First, we need to go over to the plug, click on plugins, we are going to click on admin. And on the search bar we are going to type Elementor add-ons. And we're going to scroll down a bit. And this is the one we are going to use with premium add-ons for Elementor. It will add some extra widgets to the Elementor page builder, among them the banner with the animations. So we are going to click on install now. And then we are going to click on activate. There we go. Now we are going to go to the top to the name of the site and we are going to click on this side there we go and on the top here we are going to click on edit with elementor and here we are now we are going to scroll down to an open section like this one and on the widget search bar we are going to type banner and this is one premium banners widget and we are going to click with the left mouse button, hold, drag, and release on the open section. So we can select an image from the media library. We are going to use this one right here, and we are going to click on insert media. And now we can select a size for the image. We are going to leave it full. We can add a link, and here we say effect. We are going to choose among different hover effects like this and we are going to choose the hue gray effect too like the tree five width or the hue color that five and that work and the six with the box the two so we are going to use the four like this and we can select it to be always hover like this we are going to leave that no and on the hover effect we can select zoom in zoom out scale gray scale blue, blue blue bright and sepia so we are going to choose a zoom out like this with two and we could choose a custom a for the banner and we are going to do on default and we can enable mouse tilt like this good and we can reverse it like that and we can add an extra class to the banner so we are going to go to the content and here we can select whatever we want for the banner as you can see is this part and here with this title it's for this one right here so we are going to leave those as we are for the example and we can select the bottom here and we will show and we can select the text right here and we can select the alignment we are going to move it to the middle and for the responsive option if the description text is not suiting well on a specific screen so you might enable the option which will hide it in the description text on certain sizes like you can see we are going to leave that as no and we are going to move to the star and for the image we can add a background and add some opacity and opacity on the hover from CSS filter as you can see and for the hover as well we can add some brightness for example on the hover some saturation to the color constant and the hue as you can see and we can add some border and radius and choose with blend mode among different options right here so we are going to move to the title and here we can change the color of the title we are going to select uh, this green here as you can see and we can change the typography come from the theme defaults and we can select any font we want of the ones right here and we can change the size add some weight to it as you can see transform the text add some style 
and select decoration line height and leather spacing. We can add a shadow and some margin to it. And for the description, we can do the same. We can do just a white. And we can change the typography to shadow and add some margin to it. And for the button 2 right here, we can select white for the letters. And on the hover, we are going to click again like this. Change the typography and add some color to the background green for the white and a white for the hover. As you can see, it does. And we can add some border, maybe 1px. More than perhaps a little bit more of body and we can add a border radius, shadow, margin, and for the padding we can select 5px to make it the button a little bit larger. I think it looks quite nice. So and for the container, we can add some border to the container and some border radius and box shadow. Once we have made all the changes we want to our banner, we need to save them by going to the lower left and clicking on the update button. So that's it. We have added an animated banner to our site in a quick and easy manner using the Elementor page builder and the premium add-ons for Elementor plugin. If you like the video, subscribe to our channel and share with a friend who might need help on their sites. See you the next time on Paletech.